Game Club. Yes. Every week. I've heard of it. We talk about video a video game, a specific video game that we've been playing along together, but separately. It's almost like a book club yeah, for games. Yeah, almost like a book club for games. <laughs> Couldn't have said it better myself. <laughs> and we're doing... We are playing currently Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy. Yes. We are getting very close yes. to wrapping this game. Very close. I thought we were going to wrap it. it. It was like, oh my God, are we going to wrap it? This, no, this chapter? I knew we weren't because I know how many chapters there are. So. Yes. Uh, I knew we weren't. You can play along at home with us. We are currently on chapter 13. That's the next chapter. That's the next chapter. We so we're going to talk 12. about chapter 12. So extreme spoiler alert. Yes. There is a spoiler alert. We're going to be tra- talking in depth about chapter 12 yes. of Guardians of the Galaxy. Yes. Uh, yeah, you were right about last episode. Like, I didn't it? I didn't finish the se- I didn't finish the uh, chapter. Oh, you didn't? No. Oh, you just assumed it was over? I just assumed it was over because I was like, oh. Chapter 12, yeah, or chapter 11. That must be the chapter we just finished. Jordan. Okay, so you saw the whole part with Mantis. Yeah, I just saw the whole part with Mantis, the invasion, and all that kind of stuff. And so, I was like, oh, okay, yeah, I totally didn't want to play it all. Okay, well, b- sorry, before we go, one thing I missed a few chapters ago, when we went to rescue Drax, and we were, I think it was on that level. Did you see the little, like, centaur boy running around sometimes? There'd be like a part where you're climbing through a crack and you get through it. And then this little like. Yeah. What was the deal with that? I don't know. Okay. I was wondering if I missed something or something. I just saw this little centaur running by. Was it a and I, was like, I only caught a glimpse. I, was I like, don't know what just, it was. He looked like a boy. It was. I don't know. Uh, it wasn't like a centaur, but it was like a, a dude. It was like the little guy from Hercules that played the pipe. <laughs> he was like horse legs, but a boy's oh, body, but uh, not uh, not not like four legs, just two. So I don't know what those are called. I can't remember what they're called. I anyways, I saw that guy them. running by and I was like, what the hell was that? <laughs> but uh, anyways, I wasn't sure if I missed something later in the level or what. So, um, but yeah, back to chapter 12. Yes. So the end of it was, yes, we come through this planet's being invaded. Mantis is like, I must help my people. You must go. <laughs> yeah. So she stays on the planet to help everybody get off. But while we're there, you can see up in the sky, like, Nikki's, like, on the... Yeah, Nikki's there. In the hand or whatever it is, like, floating through the sky. Very ominous looking sort of figure. Yeah. And uh, we we got to get to where... Sh- sh- Do we know why they were going to nowhere? Like, that just happened to be where they that, were going? That or? just happened to be where they were going. Oh, they're they're going to nowhere because Nikki's going to know. But like, how did we find that out? I don't remember. I don't how remember we, that either. It must have been something I missed about uh, how yeah. we would know to go to nowhere or whatever. But uh, that's basically where this chapter starts off. Is you're in the ship, everybody's there. Adam Warlock is in the ship having a tantrum yes, <laughs> sort he's, of he's not impressed with your uh leadership style yeah so you have to go <laughs> convince him that uh you know we'll we'll i'll be able to do the thing or whatever yeah and it was just in this chapter i noticed that he really likes to do i think it's alliteration where he likes oh yeah his words are like three in a row will start with m and then three will be with a and it was just like okay i don't know if that's a regular adam warlock it must be a regular thing from the comic book how they wrote adam warlock but uh have to be i was just like i didn't notice it in the previous chapters no so. i didn't either but maybe it's because he's combined whole back again? together yeah maybe it was just stood out very obviously to me that he was doing it so <laughs> yes i know i was like what is happening yeah 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 it was very like obvious um did you successfully convince him uh yes yeah me too i don't think you can fail that i don't actually. think you can fail that either maybe it seems like every way would be yeah yeah just would, get him would work excuse me he'll agree that says like okay i guess you'll do a good job oh my god excuse me apologize <laughs> but uh there's not a whole bunch of talking going on the ship this time usually in between missions there's like a bunch of talking going on and whatever this one was pretty straightforward pretty silent i think this somber. time also they're like friends now basically yeah. so they're not like just like oh yeah okay furry like i'm gonna you know whatever <laughs> where they're kind of more joking around and yeah the team's being come, friendly coming together a little bit more so i will read you know i will say that they built it up perfectly then because that one chapter with rocket raccoon where i finally was at my breaking point is where <laughs> they switched it over to be like oh okay he's not a dinkus anymore yeah so 
it was like a perfect build up there. Um, I had a little scene. You have a little scene with Rocket and just say, oh, good job. Thanks for going. He's like, oh, shucks. It's nothing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just a little puddle. <laughs> she like tries to play it down. But, uh, yep. you know, everybody's all friendly. Yeah. So we take the warp. Yeah. After interacting with people, not too, not too much is said. Take the yep. warp, head to nowhere. Yep. And you can see once you get to nowhere, you can see the giant ship of the the Raker ship. Yeah. And the tiny little nowhere head yes. just n- nestled in right next to it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and that place was huge, so that yeah. ship's even huger. Yeah, so you go in, you land. Well, first it's like we get hailed by the the ship, and uh, they're like, we got to answer. They're going to pull us out of the sky, and Drax is like, I will handle this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so he goes and he's like, you know does his spiel about like accepting accepting the promise and how they've all accepted the promise and i'm here with my dead wife and daughter <laughs> we've accepted the promise and they're like okay you can land and then he just turns and looks over at peter quill and gives him a thumbs up <laughs> <laughs> he's like i am very good at deception yes so then they land but before they land adam warlock is like see ya and just yeets himself out of the ship oh yeah like, dropping in so they're like, Adam, where are you going? <laughs> like, we're doing this together. But he just jumps out. So they're a little concerned that Adam's going to alert Raker yeah. to what's going on. Not intentionally, like, give him away, but just, like, take the fight to him before they can be prepared or whatever. Yeah. And uh, they land on uh, nowhere and come out of the ship. And it was a little weird when they come out of the ship where I think Peter's like, I'll handle this. Or I can't remember who said it, Peter yeah. or Gamora or whatever. And then it's just like there was no handling at all. The guy was just like asking, like, you know, are you ready for the reunification? Or I don't even remember what he said. Yeah, they're the like, what are you talking about? He's like, what? And like, like they wouldn't just say yes. <laughs> <laughs> I am ready. Yeah. So they totally blew it, and then they get a, we get attacked by these guys. Yeah, it's time to fight. Yeah, this was another fight where it was just like, oh, I gotta. This guy's got a shield and I got to break. There was like bullet sponge fight yeah. again, which is kind of lame, but whatever. Yeah. You just basically do a bunch of fighting through nowhere where it's just totally destroyed. Virtually unrecognizable. I mean, I didn't recognize a single thing, basically. Yeah, it was all it was all messed up. You you go to the bar again, the outside of the bar. Oh, and, I guess. And yeah, Rocket's you could sort of tell. Disappointed that it's uh, been destroyed. You and, could sort of tell it was the bar. Yeah. And they're like, what are we going to do? Oh, we're going to rebuild yeah. for sure. Nowhere's been through worse than this. Yeah. Um, so there is a spot uh-huh. where you fight a bunch of dudes and then you keep climbing through like the old broken stuff with all the zigzaggy areas. Yeah. And you get to this spot where there's a place on the right where Grimoire can cut through or there's a bunch of guys up the front where you could fight. And I was like, oh, I'll go to the right and see if this is a secret area. She cuts through. That's not I, the secret area. And you go through and you do the little side saddle along two little areas. Yeah. And I was like, okay, every the whole crew is over here, which means this is not the secret area. Yeah. So I go and turn around. Yeah. So I'm like, I got to go to the secret area and fight those guys. Yeah. And I go back. I go into, I go shimmy past the one shimmy past area. And then I go to an attempt to shimmy past the other second shimmy past yeah. area. But as soon as I get past it, and I try to go up the stairs, it turns me around instantly. Oh, wow. And then I have to shimmy past there. And so I was like, oh, okay. So I turn around, shimmy past, and like, okay. So it's so, just like you can't go back. Yeah, I can't go back. And then I try and get through, and it's like, nope, turns me around instantly, and I start shimmying through the little oh, gap. that sucks. And then I'm like, okay, well, I'll just continue mm-hmm. on. Yeah. And then I try and continue on back towards the car- the crew, and it turns me around, and I what? have to shimmy past the thing. I'm like, and You're I could, stuck? I got stuck. Oh my god! Shimmying, it wouldn't let me not shimmy oh through my this god. little slot area. I got completely stuck. Wow! So, so what did like, you have to do? So I was like, I'll go through. I'll save my game on the other side of the shimmy spot. Yeah, where I need to go. Yeah, and then reload it. Uh-huh. And so I reloaded it. Yeah, but it reloaded me back with the cre- with the crew. Oh, <laughs> not on that side. So weird. I'm like, okay, so maybe it was just a bug, and I had to reload and shimmy. So I yeah. go back and shimmy and shimmy, and it's like turns me around wow. instantly. I'm like, oh come on! Wow. Yeah, I remember that part because I was like, just like you, I was like, okay, I'm going to go through the wires first. So I was just getting ready to get Gamora to cut the wires and someone's like, they're attacking. And then they were running down from that other way (laughs) to attack me. So uh, there was nothing over there. I don't think it Uh. was just, I think if you went that way and then to the left, there was like some crafting materials, but I think that was it that was there. Hmm. But uh, 
Yeah, I was going to go that way too, but uh, I got attacked by those guys. But right before that one in the battle, right by right past the bar, I don't know if it happened to you there, but they're all attacking down the hallway. So I kept trying to fall, like, you know, move around or whatever. And I would fall back, but it would like, I would go back too far. Not even that far. Like literally I probably backed like five meters up and it would just teleport me back into the battle every time. Weird. Yeah. It wouldn't let me go back further. It just would keep (laughs) like literally I would teleport back into the battle. And that happened at another point in this area, too, where I was like trying to like, you know, move around and it would just be like, no, you're getting back in the battle right now, (laughs) which it was weird, but it wasn't game breaking or anything like that. Um, There's a lot of little areas where you have to use your wind power to pull down levers and stuff and get through little areas. Very, very linear. Not much exploration that I could find. There was uh, I found one outfit, I think I found rockets like four horsemen one i think maybe no no i oh, found rockets uh, like junior peter outfit yeah. <laughs> yeah um i did die once but it was like in a weird area where you had to jump between these like floating platforms and i was trying to dodge around while i was getting shot and i would fall off the edge and it would teleport me back up but then i got shot off the edge again and then it <laughs> happened again and i just died it killed me <laughs> so it was just like that was kind of lame so there's one battle spot before that spot i think where there's a little raised cylindrical pillar in the middle yeah and that's and you do a little fighting around there but underneath that area Mm -hmm. there's a little secret area with some crafting material and an outfit oh there's an outfit down there what outfit was it i don't know i couldn't get down Uh, there okay Uh, there was like there's a little drop-off spot and a energy of a face battery there and so i would drop down on that face battery i would land and then it would teleport me back up huh i was like what how do I even get down? I don't here? remember I that. Find a way to get down. I there. thought I only got the one outfit, but maybe I got two. I'm not sure. There are two. There's three, I think. Okay. In in this area, and that one down below, I just could not get hmm. to. Interesting. A multiple times, like walking around the entire place, couldn't find. Is out that how the to get area there. where you had to move the block that was hidden behind the little lever you had to pull that had Drax carry the block around? No, 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 no. Okay, different spot. Okay. The um, floor was all electrified. Hmm. I couldn't get down there. I couldn't figure I don't it out. Remember that spot? I must have missed it. Yeah, there's like not much exploration in this game, but sometimes it's like, how did I miss the area? Yeah. So. Yeah, and then there's that spot you I think you were talking about where it's like all snipers and yeah. mortar guys. Yeah. <laughs> I died there because I was like, oh, what's this red square or circle square? And there's just like four mortars just yeah. Bam, don't bam, stand bam. there. Like, oh my god. Yeah. Wow, red red means don't stand there. <laughs> red means dead. Um, I unlocked the last skill in this area for for like the last uh, Peter Quill. Oh yeah. Uh, upgrade. Oh yeah. I unlocked all the skills, the final ones in this area too. Yeah, I did too. I had like eight points <laughs> and I was just like, oh, I have a lot of points here. Yeah. So I did them. But I mean, I don't use any of Peter Quill's special abilities really, so <laughs> it doesn't matter the too much. The only one I use is his ultimate really, because his other ones kind of suck. Yeah. I mean, I flew around shooting one time, but I just was like, whatever. This yeah. This doesn't really do it for me. Uh, the other characters ones, I only ever really use the same ones. Like I always use Groot's one where he like holds them in place. Yeah. And then, I mean, I use Gamora while she'll sword at a guy or whatever. So, <laughs> but we only have like one ultimate. No, we have two ultimates left. No, on one more. Cause this, Just, we, all, this, we don't have Groot's. Yeah. We don't have Groot's yet in this. Uh, Gamora gets hers. Cause yeah. she sees a kid. She sees a kid being slurped, slurped up to the promise. And she goes absolutely berserk in this battle. You don't, even, you don't even get to use her because she's just going around crazy just yeah. fighting everyone she can just going bananas and, she, and there's a one cut scene where she beats this guy down and yeah, just when he's punches on the guy, him just in the punches head him in the face 10 over times and over and over again yeah. it's like holy crap yeah she went crazy she goes absolutely berserk and then once she calms down you get her back on side she gets her ultimate ability yeah which is pretty good yeah pretty good executioner's strike it's not as cool looking as rockets for sure (laughs) (laughs) rockets 30 gun attack is pretty good but uh uh, you know when she's having her break she like admits she killed um what's her name Uh, her sister i can't remember her name nebula Nebula. Yeah, yeah yeah nebula and uh yeah whatever it was a sad scene yeah um 
the I think the only other thing really that happens in this chapter is you finally get to the battle with Nikki where she's being juiced up by all the faith oh, we need energy. To, we're here to get Cosmo. Oh, so right. Cosmo. Where to get Cosmo. I forgot about Cosmo. Cosmo's the dog that can talk. Yeah. He's like a, a Russian cosmonaut dog. Yeah. And he's extremely psychic. Yes. Like crazy psychic. Yeah. And we come across him. He's, Accepted being, the he's promise. protecting himself with a shield and yeah. the, the dudes are blasting him. And then he finally accepts the promise. Yeah. And so you have to convince him. Yes. To come back to come back to nowhere because he's on Earth, drunk, running around, yeah. catching balls, being with his humans yeah, and, yeah. and being all like dog like. And he's like, no, this is it. This is the ticket. I, I don't have any psychic it. powers. Yeah. Did but, you convince him? Yeah, I convinced him because they were like, what do they smell like? What do your humans smell like? He's like, they have no smell. Yes. This is not real. Yeah. <laughs> I convinced him too. Um, and then he ran off to, I guess, I don't know what he's going to run off to do. Yeah, Fight the baddies? Either, I, I don't know. They're just like, kind of like, we should go help him. And they're like, eh, he'll be fine. <laughs> we'll be, he'll be I fine. I can't remember if it's before this or after this, we see uh, Raker and Adam comes flying in finally and starts oh, fighting. Oh, yeah. Them. Was that before or after this? I don't think it really matters. No, it, it happens. We, we find Raker and Adam just comes in and starts fighting him. Fighting him. Well, like, he's, you lost your way, he friend. doesn't fight him immediately. He tries to like appeal to him or whatever. But yeah. Raker, I guess, saw it. Well, thought he saw Adam die. So he's just like, no, this isn't real. <laughs> so then they get into a fight and then <laughs> Rocket decides, oh, this is a great time for me to join in the fight. And he shoots and he shoots Adam Warlock in the ass. And Adam <laughs> yeah. looks at him like, really? <laughs> <laughs> and then they get knocked off the platform and they're down to. Yeah, it's whatever. Just a big bunch of fighting. Yeah. But then, yes, we get to Nikki, who's she's like in there's like a giant, I don't know, giant machine thing that with she's a in. hand that she's yeah. in. And they're trying to juice her up by sending all the faith energy into the hand to give it to her. So the idea is that we have to save her, basically. Yeah. Oh, and throughout the whole level, there's like a lot of options. Like, what do you want to do? Like, you know, stop Raker, or get Nikki or whatever. So I just was like, ah, fuck, I'll get Nikki. I chose all the options to get Nikki, basically. Yeah, so did I. Um, so this room has these four, like, glowing cables you have to unplug from these batteries to save Nikki. And obviously, you have to use your little wind ability to slurp them out. So I start the battle, fight my way through, and I'm looking around, and you get to a point. So that's one of the annoying things about this game is they keep, like, in battles, they say the same thing over and over. Yeah. It'll be like you're fighting these robots and it'll be like, ah, oh, it seems like I've been shooting them for an hour. <laughs> Meanwhile, they are at like one hit point. Yeah. And then you'll, you know, a minute later, it'll be like, it seems like I've been shooting this guy for an hour. <laughs> it's just so annoying. So yeah. anyways, I'm fighting around and I'm jumping around and I get to a point and Gamora's like, oh, we can use the skiffs to get up to the other area. So I'm like, OK, perfect. The skiff comes in and I'm like, how do I get up on the skiff? because <laughs> it's like so high in the air so i'm like okay maybe if i jump i'll grab onto the side of it no that doesn't work so i'm like okay i remember before you could shoot the skiffs down and they'd like crash i'm like okay maybe if i shoot the skiff it'll like lower down and i can jump on it then no it doesn't work and the skiffs keep coming and i keep killing all the guys and trying to get the skiffs down and i'm like what the hell am i doing <laughs> wrong like i don't get it and she keeps saying like oh we can use the skiffs to get to the other area and i'm like what am I missing? Like, I do not understand what I'm missing here. And I'm trying to jump on every other block to jump on these skiffs. And like, <laughs> I killed probably like 30 guys in that area yeah. from the skiffs. And then I was like, oh, they're just telling me like, it's not even at that point in the battle yet that I need to know about the skiffs. Oh, interesting. Because... I had not pulled out the one plug yeah, out of so the one you can the get first to. Plug, they all come yeah. down and line up. But the, all these other <laughs> skiffs were flying through. So I'm like, okay, what am I missing here about these skiffs? So as soon as I pulled that plug, it was like, oh yeah, here's the skiffs parked in the perfect spot for <laughs> yeah. you to jump up to the platform. It's like, why would they have Gamora say that already? Like, holy crap. I wasted so much time because I thought. Yeah, that was, that's weird. Yeah, it was not cool, but. I got it done. There's, yeah, Cosmo the dog. Cosmo looks in full, full ray trace mode. Yeah. Um. So, yeah, it was, I wasted a lot of time doing that. But as soon as, 
as soon as that happened, it was like I didn't have to fight any more guys. I could just like jump on their ship, go over, yank the next one, and then just go to the next platform. I didn't fight anybody after that. <laughs> so you finally pull all the plugs, and Nikki's free but she's like dad why won't you accept the promise <laughs> yeah essentially. Not, not exactly but uh, she's like you know why won't you leave me alone like this is my thing i'm gonna do it right leave me alone raker is back there yeah raker's defeated adam warlock i think adam's body was there i'm yeah, not sure it was there and uh so Raker's talking about, you can do it, you know, Nikki, you're the best. And she's like, yeah, I am the best. I want to use all the power. Oh, yeah. She's like, basically keep Adam alive. I want to show him my power by doing this that he couldn't do, basically. Yeah. I'm going to channel it all, but we got to go channel it at wherever the other places or whatever. And Raker's like, if you think you can do it, sure. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> Which the way... They were saying it. I think Nikki knows that it's not good. And she's just sort of playing along with Raker. Huh. That she's going to turn. Like at the last second, Raker's going to be like, yes, yes. And then he's, he's going to be like, no, what are you doing? Ah! <laughs> she's going to be like, gotcha. Yeah, basically. <laughs> That's kind of the way I think it's going to play out. But she's going to punk Raker? <laughs> I think so. I think so. Um. So they leave and they're like, well, where are we going to go? We don't want to want to know. And Rock is like, yeah, I tagged Adam Warlock. And they're like, <laughs> what? I shot him in the yeah. Butt. He's like, I put a tracker on him when I shot him in the ass. <laughs> and they're like, oh, OK. Thank you, Rockets. <laughs> so uh, that's basically the end of the chapter. We're uh, ready to fly off to wherever yeah. we need to go next, which I don't actually know where it is yet. But. Yeah, I played the next chapter. So you're going to need to play, too. Because the next chapter is like five minutes long. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right. It's just a bunch of talking, and then it's the next chapter. Okay. So that would be 13 and 14, and then uh, there's two more chapters after it. Because yeah. I think there's only 16 chapters. Yes. Yeah, so we'll be we'll be done it pretty quick. Exactly. We'll have a couple playthroughs. Yeah. So I'm ready to see where it goes next. Um, yeah. So far, so good. Again, still the same thing. The fighting sucks, but <laughs> yeah, it's pretty bare bones. Um, but. Yeah. Yeah, I definitely have everything unlocked at this point. All the character abilities, yeah, all too. of the upgrades for Star Lord. Oh, uh, but still missing a lot of outfits. In though. the next chapter, you get the last upgrade for Star Lord because I don't have it yet. No, well, I don't have plasma shot. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. The next uh, elemental shot. Yeah, for Star Lord. You don't have that yet. No, I don't have that. Yet. Oh, okay, no, no. no, no. Yeah, that'll be that'll happen at the same time for both of us. Yeah, but I have. I all thought you of just the... meant because you play the next two. Oh no, no, I yeah, only yeah. play the next one. Oh, it's very short. oh, okay, I see, I see. I was I see. like, okay, well, we got to figure out where this is going, and then I and then it just went, and I'm like, okay, that was super short. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Yeah, uh, I have everything yeah. except for Groot's ultimate, and yeah, me too. and the the next elemental shot. Yeah. Um, yeah, I recommend it more for the story, really, than the gameplay. Yeah, the and game. the visuals. Yeah, oh yeah, the graphics everything and everything. Great. Yeah, the art design and everything's great. So mm -hmm. if you have Game Pass, this game was just added to Game Pass, so you can join in the sh game club and catch up to us. It wouldn't take that long. I think no. I looked and I've played for 16 hours, I think, like that, or something yeah. like that. Which is, uh, there's a bunch of wasted time in there, too. So Faffing about, finding the secrets. Oh, yeah, just <laughs> looking around. Especially nowhere. The first time you go in there, you got to look at everything. Yeah, and try read everything. everything. <laughs> I have, start, when I was streaming it, I wasn't reading everything. But now I, I am, just because, I don't know. I can. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but uh, once this is done, I don't know what exactly we're doing next for Game Club. So if you have any ideas, like put it on the Discord. Let yeah, us know it. what you think a next Game Club game could be. It could be anything. It could be you. It could be you. <laughs> Maybe we'll play The Witcher. Ooh, except that's not really chapter based. We could go through the main story. Yeah, line, true. Just do the main storyline and not divert. But, you know, I mean, in, yes. in that vein, it's we could like, play cyberpunk. <laughs> I mean, it's exactly it's hard to, you know, whatever, play a non chapter based game for something like this. But yeah. we could figure something out. Yeah. Uh, anyways, that was supposed to be my terrible segue to the news. Oh, yeah, terrible. <laughs> that was awful. I didn't even see it. Uh, 